Hey tubers, welcome back. I'm um, just going to show you a quick video. It's uh, it's really freaking cold out here so I'm not going to be out here long. Um, my furnace is decided to quit on me today so um, but at least it's just the shop so I don't have to worry. The babies are nice warm in the house. But uh, I wanted to show you this quick demonstration. Um, Got a couple of emails asking like uh, about glow sticks, stuff like that. So I went ahead and I made the chemicals, um, pre-mixed them, and I left the last step to show you. But uh, I'll put the name of the chemicals at the starting of the end of the video, um, just so you can get an idea if you want to make them yourself or, um, you know, it's probably cheaper to go and buy them because it's pretty expensive to do it this way. But uh, it can be done. I mean probably not as good as quality as what they sell from the, the factory or whatever but uh, yeah I'll give you a quick demonstration anyway so got our two chemicals I just put them in separate little you know containers We've got this one there it's hydrogen peroxide and then uh, this is the chemical mixture but I'll actually I could probably pour them into one container here as you can see pouring it in don't even know if this will work. This is the first first shot at it, so so poured it in. Give it a stir, and uh, oh, it's glowing on the spoon. I don't know if you can see that or not. It is glowing a little bit, but uh, the colder it is, the harder it is to get glowing. Oh, you can see it on the. I don't know if you catch it on video or not, but I'm going to shut this light off for a sec so you can see. I don't know if you can see that glowing. It's really hard to tell. It is glowing, but uh, easier to tell with the fluorescent lights, I guess. It's a very dim glow, but the hotter the chemicals are, like not to the boiling point obviously, but the warmer they are, the uh, brighter it'll get. You can see it glowing pretty good on the it's glowing pretty bright actually um, for being as cold as it is. I'm going to turn this back on. I'm going to heat it up a little and show you. Turn the lights back on so I can see what the hell I'm doing. Okay, now I can see what I'm doing. Alright, I'm going to shut this off for a sec. I'm going to pour it into a hot plate so you can see what's going on. Now as you can see, the hotter it gets, the brighter it's going to glow. I just poured this right out of the cup. You can see it's still glowing a little bit in the cup. I just poured it right into the hot plate. It's pretty cool. You can have a lot of fun with it. Um, I don't know what kind of chemicals this releases or anything like that, but uh, you can see it gets gets pretty bright the warmer it is. I mean, it's minus 15 out here right now, so it's pretty fucking cold. But, uh, yeah, it gets it's pretty bright. I don't know what it'll do. Like I've never, like I said, I'm not uh, an expert chemist, but uh, I do like to have some fun. I think it just dies out the hotter it gets, but and it glows whatever you touch. You know, you can put it on your finger. Your finger will glow. You know, it's pretty cool stuff. Wipe it on your coat. Your coat will glow. You know, the shop rag, whatever. <laughs> but. Uh, uh, it's pretty cool stuff and just wanted to give you a quick video on it I'll show you how to make it or I'll tell you how to make it and you can uh, experiment on your own thanks for watching tubers